The year is 2025 and we are on a field owned by farmer Carl. Carl is happy because his farm is economically viable thanks to modern technology and sustainable thanks to the integration of his fields into the local ecosystem. Despite intensive cultivation, Carl's fields are home to healthy flora and fauna. However, that was not always the case. Just a few years ago, Carl often had to resort to the use of pesticides because his plants were infested with pests and diseases. The agents accumulated in the soil and thereby ended up in the food chain. The ecological balance was severely disturbed. In addition, the emergence of weeds required the use of large amounts of herbicides. Carl had to constantly monitor his plants personally, which resulted in a lot of work and a financial burden. All this made Carl quite unhappy, because he is very conscious of the environment, always looking to have a positive impact on its preservation. Then Carl heard about new types of robots that could help him with these challenges. Kevin and Simon, two researchers at the Fraunhofer IPA in Stuttgart, had worked with their colleagues to develop a new digital system centered around robots like Kurt. Thanks to its cognitive abilities, Kurt can not only take care of all the work related to crop protection, but it also autonomously applies fertilizer, waters the plants and even harvests the crops. With Kurt's help, Carl saves a lot of time and can therefore make better use of his resources. In doing so, Kurt does not take decisions for agricultural processes alone, but takes guidance from Carl by using cloud systems such as the agricultural data space. As a result, Carl no longer has to be present on the fields at all times, but can use his farm management system to monitor and control the processes carried out by Kurt and its intelligent assistants at any time. He personally decides who is given access to the data collected by Kurt and for what purpose these data should be used. By analyzing the gathered data, Carl can digitally map the growth processes on the fields and simulate new cultivation models. With these data and the help of Kurt on the fields, new crop combinations can be grown in an economically efficient way. With such mixed crop systems, Kurt helps Carl to utilize synergies between the crops and to increase ecological diversity on the fields. Thanks to Kurt, Carl can avoid the use of chemical pesticides and that is why he makes an important contribution to an intact ecosystem, as it provides sufficient habitat for bees and other insects to perform their natural tasks. Thanks to digital technologies like Kurt and the research of Kevin, Simon and their colleagues, Carl can now fully focus on what is most important to him in his profession. Sustainable agriculture and food supply for his fellow people. If you too would like to make your farming sustainable, or if you would like to learn more about Kurt and the technology behind it, we invite you to reach out to us.